Today, Mongo, we're competing in a boat build challenge. Boats are sick, Wudo. Let's do it. But be careful, guys, because at sunset, a horde of sharks is gonna attack. That's not good. We better start building our boats quickly. My boat is gonna be so much better than yours, Wudo. I don't think so, Mongo. Check this out, Axie. All I need to do is type in this command called slash slash pace to build us a massive empty boat that we can build in. Whoa, Wudo, that boat is huge. Oh my gosh, Axie, this isn't just any normal boat. This is a giant mega yacht. Check it out. Doesn't it look amazing? Where are you, Wudo? It's so big I got lost. Don't worry, Axie. I'm right behind you. Look at all the different floors that we'll be able to build on. I think we should get started on the first floor over here at the front of the boat. Just look at its size compared to our tiny island. It doesn't even compare. Monko's like a little speck from up here. We're so gonna beat him in this challenge. You're right, Axie. But check this out. This area is perfect for our bedrooms where we can enjoy a nice view of the ocean. Let's start off with some lime green blocks. I want to build my bed the biggest right in the middle so that I get the best view. No, I'm going to build my bed the biggest. Hey, guys, guess what? My boat is super gigantic. You better watch out. No, it's not, Mongo. I guarantee you that my boat is 10 times bigger than what your little puny one probably is. Yeah, okay, Wudo. We'll see at the end of the build challenge that my boat is way better. Ha, in your dreams, Mongo. Check this out, Axie. Right now, I put down all these nice big beds with some nightstands to the left and right so I can put down some cookies or put down a nice little lamp so that I can see in the middle of the night. Isn't that sick? That's really cool and all, Wudo, but I just built the same thing but bigger. Hey, you can't take my spot, Axie. It doesn't matter because my bed is actually blocking your view, which means that I still get the better view. Wait, seriously? Oh, it's okay. I can fix that. I just have to build up so that my beds are elevated. Okay, Axie, you know what? Then I'm going to have to build Manga's bed right behind you and make sure that it's even more elevated. Hey! Don't give him the best view. Oh, yeah, you're right. I don't want to give that stinky guy a good view. Maybe what I can do is put a bed over here, but block it off with wool. And instead, what I can do is I can grab a painting so that he can look at a fake sunset and not the real one. That's what he deserves for being such a meanie. Hey, Wudo, I hear you talking trash. You better stop before I come over there and remove your build. Oh, yeah, Mom? Mongo, you think you can remove my massive boat? I'd love to see you try. That's gonna take you longer than building your own boat. Wait, what? I didn't even realize that your boat was that big, Wudo. You know what? I just have to work harder to make my boat better. <laughs> I'd love to see you try, Mongo, because it is not happening. Come on, Axie. Let's place down some nice sofas as well so that we can sit and relax wherever we want. Oh, that looks pretty good. These are really, really comfortable sofas. Have you ever sat on a real sofa before, Axie? I don't think I've ever seen an axolotl sitting in one. You can see one right now, Udo, because I'm never going to leave this sofa ever. Wow, it looks so big compared to you, Axie. You just look so tiny compared to how big it is. Hey, don't call me tiny, Wudo. Take that back. Well, it's the truth. Sorry. I'm going to build a huge sofa for you that you'll look super tiny in. Well, actually, I did put down a sofa, and it doesn't look that big at all. Sit in this one, Wudo. What? That's not a sofa. Axie, you can always come to my side and help me build. Wudo is super trash at building. Sorry, but I'll pass because your building looks super newbie, Mongo. Oh, yeah. If you want to build with 
him, Axie, you can consider yourself doomed. There's no way that he's gonna win this build challenge. We'll see about that, Wudo. My boat has cannons. Cannons? Are you kidding me? Ha, cannons are for babies, Mongo. We're gonna have nuclear missiles on ours. We are? Wait, what? How can you even add something like that? Just kidding, Axie. I don't have any real nuclear missiles, but maybe if I ask my friend, we can get some. Who's your friend? And why do they have nuclear missiles? Don't worry about it, Axie. I need you to worry about something more important right now, like these hot tubs. Check it out. We can sit inside of them and enjoy some nice, warm, bubbly water while we look outside at the view of the ocean how cool is that? That's really cool. This bedroom is looking really good, even though it's a little bit unusual. Don't worry, Axie. I think it looks perfectly beautiful in my eyes, and I think we should add a couple more decorations to make it perfect. For example, how about we add some hanging lights? That's really creative. I'm gonna hang mine everywhere. What? Don't hang them everywhere, Axie. We want to share there's some space between the each of us so that everyone has a couple of decorations that they can enjoy in the bedroom. No, everywhere. Oh gosh, Axie, look what I did right now. It's perfectly even. We have some green lights and some red lights and also some pink lights. That does look pretty good, Wudo. We're master designers. Exactly. I think our luxury bedroom is looking fire. Is there anything else that we can add? Oh, no. Let me think about it for a second. <gasps> I think we can add food. Food? Are you serious? Actually, I am quite hungry, Axie, and I can't just eat my cookie snacks forever. Do you think we should build something like a restaurant on this boat? That could be really cool, and then you can cook for me all day while I sleep and lay in the hot tub. I'm not gonna cook for you all day. I'm I'm gonna cook for all of us, Axie. Remember, this is our boat, not just one person's boat. Okay, fine. Maybe I'll contribute a little bit. All right, Axie. I think the restaurant should be on the second floor. Look at this big open space. It can be an open air restaurant, which means that it doesn't get covered by any glass or a roof, so we can soak in all that beautiful sunshine. Cool. What kind of food should we have here? I think we should serve everything. Everything? Is that even possible to serve, Axie? Yeah, it's pretty easy. We just make a huge table and fill it with all kinds of food and allow customers to take whatever they want. Oh, I get what you mean. Are you trying to make a buffet, Axie? No, what's a buffet? That sounds weird. Well, a buffet is where you give your customers all the options options of food to choose from so they can have anything from cakes and cookies to other foods like steaks and soups and pretty much anything you could ever have for example let's start off by placing down some beef stew you want to try some axie that looks pretty good but woodle i don't want to call it a buffet i want to call it an everything restaurant the everything restaurant sounds official enough to me axie let's put down on some fancy plates so our customers can take them and fill them up with as much food as they want. This is gonna be such a good restaurant! Haha, <laughs> Mongo, do you hear that? We're making the best boat ever! Look at his Axie! It looks so lame! Does your boat have fireworks? Hold on! Mongo has fireworks? That's sick! I want fireworks like that! No, Wudo! Your boat will never be better than mine. Matter of fact, I have a second boat to my boat. Okay, Axie, you know what? Maybe we do actually need some nuclear missiles to take down Mongo. He's not gonna disrupt my amazing buffet like this. Should we do something to set him back a little bit? What do you think we should do? I really wanted to eat some of my food first. We can do that, but I also think we should prank him. Ooh, pranking him would be awesome. Maybe what we can do is we could put a bunch of holes inside his boat, Axie. Should we do that? That 
That's so mean. But yeah, I think desperate times call for desperate measures. Then come on, we can put the restaurant on hold for right now. I have some potions of invisibility that I can splash ourselves with. And now we can go raid his boat. Come on, Axie. Be very, very secretive. I'm being so secretive. Oh gosh, I can still see Axie's tail, but it's okay. Mongo won't be able to. Let's see what he's doing now. I can't wait to take out Budo and Axie. Luckily, I can beat up this training dummy for now. But when I see them, it's over. Oh gosh, Mongo really thinks he can beat me up. Well, how about we drown him instead? Let me just grab some sharks real quick and place them all around his boat because more are gonna come on the way anyways. Now what I can do is I can go right underneath him and break these blocks. And now the sharks are gonna have their feast. <laughs> Wait, what? There's so many sharks here. I need to use my fireworks to get back at them. Whoa! Look, Axie. Mongo is panicking so hard right now. His fireworks are so useless. Let's poke fun at him. Hey, Mongo. Are you having a firework party or something? No, Wudo. What are you talking about? Oh my gosh, Wudo's so annoying. You know what? The sharks just gave me an idea. I'm gonna go over to Wudo's build and spawn in a bunch of sharks to prank him. <laughs> Not if I use the cannon to destroy his boat. Oh, it didn't work. What? Axie, try again. Okay, give me one second. Bye. Wait, what? Why is my boat shaking? You know what? It doesn't matter. Let me just go over here. And now I just need to spawn in every single shark on planet Earth. There you go. And now that those are spawned in, I can just get on my boat and escape. Does Mongo realize that my boat is like 10 times more massive than these sharks? Oh my gosh. You know what? I need to get rid of this pest. Let me just grab a bazooka real quick. Aim and take down his boat wait what in the world just happened come on and boom i think his boat is on fire my boat it's gone what's going on <laughs> now manga will never be able to make fun of me he's gone completely sunk in the water oh gosh you know what i need to go back to building so i can beat wudo come on axie let's go back to our building and finish building our amazing restaurant. That was so funny. I know, right? He didn't even suspect anything. Oh, yeah. He probably thinks it was something from the ocean, but it was actually just us. And you know what else we're also gonna do, Axie? We're gonna put down our food. I tried to spell everything, but I think I'm gonna run out of space. Axie, right now it says Evevev. You kind of spelled it wrong. What? Oh, no. It does say FFF. Axie, do axolotls go to spelling school? Because I don't think they ever do. No, Wudo. We don't go to spelling school. We spend our time doing more important things, such as eating cake. I see. I don't know if I'd call that more important, but according to axolotl knowledge, it probably is more important for you guys. Yep. And because I'm out of space, I'm just going to make a smiley face over here. You are? Aw, that's pretty cool, Axie. Now that you're done with that, we have a nice beautiful sign for our restaurant. I guess the only thing I need to do now is just pick out some more food to put on the table. And luckily, we have plenty of options. I'm actually going through right now and picking a bunch. We're gonna have sandwiches and burgers and cakes and soda. Oh man, it's gonna be awesome. Are we going to feed the sharks when they come to kill us? No. Why would we feed those pesky sharks? They're trying to kill us, Axie. Maybe they won't want to kill us and eat us if they have other interesting food to eat. I see. That is a good point, but I don't think they really care. They want to eat us regardless. Okay, Woodle. I 
guess we won't try to feed the sharks. We should make some defenses later, though, just in case. I think that's a great idea, Axie. But my food must come first. Let's see. I'm gonna add some lobster, tacos, noodles. I can even add some sushi and cheese. Those all sound really tasty to me. I'm gonna put the sushi on the cheese, and then I'm gonna put the lobster on the sushi on the cheese. Oh, that's an interesting combination, Axie. What if I put an axolotl on top of the lobster? Then you would be an axolotl lobster. That sounds pretty tasty to me. No, Wudo. I would be an axolotl eating a lobster. You can't eat me. Are you sure I can't, Taxi? What if I just get a little nibble? No. Then I'm gonna nibble all the turtles in the world. Oh, gosh. Okay, I was just joking, Axi. Don't actually do that, please. I'll just eat these pizza and mushrooms instead. That looks pretty tasty to me. I don't like pizza, Wudo. Let's replace it with cake. No, Axie, we can't replace it. You know why? Why? Because we're actually gonna have an entire dessert section on the complete opposite side. Let's put down every single dessert ever known to man. But, Wudo, cake's not a dessert. Cake is a breakfast, lunch, and dinner. Axie, cake is a dessert. You know that, right? No, I eat it all day. It's my main meal for every single course. Well, I think axolotls are just built a little bit differently. If I ate that many cakes, I would get really fat. You are a little round. I'm gonna poke you. Hey, I'm not round, Axie. Don't call me fat. You're not fat, just a little bit squishy. Okay, Axie, I've heard enough. I'm gonna start placing down some other desserts right now. Check it out. We have some tarts, which look really tasty. I can put down some puddings and even an apple pie. Cool! Can I eat it all right now? Um, nom, 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 nom. Wait, what, Axie? You can't eat dessert before dinner, silly. You need to eat your dinner over here and then you can eat the dessert. Oh, I think I get it. So, I need to mix the dinner and the dessert to create dessert dinner. Axie, that's not what you're supposed to do, but that doesn't sound too bad, actually, to try out. I'm just gonna place down some gold blocks over here to finish the luxury look. And then, do you wanna try making your dinner dessert or whatever you called it? Okay, let me think. What should I add from this side? Mm, maybe some cheese and this hot dog, and then I can put the cheese. Let me grab that, and I can put the hot dog on. What should I put them on, Woodle? Maybe you can grab two cookies and put the hot dog in the middle. Then you can have a cookie hot dog sandwich. Oh, okay. I'm gonna get an oven, and I'm gonna cook it all together in this corner. Oh, gosh, Axie. Just be careful. I don't know if I trust you with that stuff. I'll let you know how it goes. Okay, Axie. In that case, I'm gonna start putting down a nice big dining table in the middle so that we can eat all of our food together. That sounds nice, but I don't want to invite Mongo because we have to beat him. I know, Axie. We do have to beat him, but at the same time, it's nice to invite our friends. I don't want to leave him out and hungry. Trust me, he's never gonna be able to survive on his current boat. That's true. Maybe we should bring him on here and then blow up his boat. Ooh, I actually like that idea. Hey, Mongo, can we blow up your boat so that you can come to our boat only? What? Why would I allow you to do that? Your build sucks, and my build is way better. Oh, okay, Mongo. You want to go that route? That's fine. We'll just destroy you. <laughs> Wait, what? What do you mean by that, Woodo? Anyways, Axie, check this out. I just put down a bunch of delicious sodas that we can drink with our meals. Doesn't that look tasty, too? Yeah! 
It looks so good. But I finished my dessert dinner. Do you want to see it? Um, Axie, what in the world is this? Why does it look burnt? Well, I put it all in the oven and then I set it to 2 million degrees and then it kind of came out like this. Uh-oh, that's not good, Axie. I wouldn't eat that if I were you. Eating burnt food can actually be really unhealthy for you. That can't be true. Let me just give it a little nibble and nom 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 nom. nom. Ugh, gross! I'm gonna go wash my mouth out in the ocean! Axie, don't run away too far! I was just finishing setting the table. I need to give everyone a plate so that they can eat their food. Give me one second. I'm drinking the ocean. Uh-oh, Axie. You know what? Maybe you shouldn't be allowed to cook ever again. But I have to say, our boat restaurant is actually looking kind of amazing. I know that Mongo doesn't have a restaurant as cool as ours. Right, Axie? Yeah, probably not. But maybe Mongo would be better at cooking than me. Axie, why does Mongo's boat look like an airplane? What in the world is he trying to do? If it looks like an airplane, that's a really weird looking airplane. It is, Axie. So come on, let's not worry about that stinky guy. How about we go to the back of the boat now that we worked on two floors of the front and we can build something that I've been wanting to build forever. You see how big the ocean is, Axie? Imagine we could put all that fun into a giant pool. A pool in the middle of the ocean? That's a great idea. It is an amazing idea, Axie. So how about we build a diamond pool right over here on the top of the boat? And then what we can do is we can build a giant water slide going all the way to the bottom. That sounds so cool. Where do we start? Let's start over here on the top floor, Axie. In order to make the pool, I need to write out a command like this. What this is going to do is help us build the exterior of the pool so that we can put water inside of it. See? Can we put lava? Come on, Axie. Are you joking right now? You know what lava's gonna do to you? It's gonna turn you into cooked axolotl. And if you're gonna get cooked, then I might have to try and see how you taste. Wait, what? You can't do that. That sounds illegal. Exactly, Axie. So let's not put lava inside of it, okay? How about instead you just put some normal water? And while you do that, I'm gonna start building this slide that looks super duper awesome. I bet you could take a boat and you could race down it too. And I know I'd be way faster than you, Axie. No, you wouldn't. I'm smaller, so I would go down faster. I don't think that's how it works. If we're both in a boat, wouldn't it technically go the same speed? Yeah, well, you weigh like 2 million pounds, so it would probably go slower for you. Wait, do I actually weigh 2 million pounds, Axie? Something like that. I don't really know exact numbers. Oh, no. I think I am really fat. Maybe we should build a gym, too, and you would have to be required to go to it, Axie. Why me? You're the one who weighs 2 million pounds. Oh, gosh, you're right. Hey, Mom, Mongo, do you weigh 2 million pounds too? Wait, what? No, I don't, Budo. Currently, I'm working on my gym exercise that I can work on in the ocean so I can be the most fit Minecraft player of all time. You're not gonna be that fit, Mongo. Come on. What type of ocean exercise would you do anyways? Jumping into the ocean, swimming 100 miles, talking to turtles. That's an exercise in and of itself, Budo. Talking to turtles and jumping in the ocean is an exercise, Mongo? Since when? Since today, because I made it an exercise. Can eating cake be an exercise too, then? No, Axie. Eating food is not an exercise. That's how you actually gain the weight, silly. Mm, no, that doesn't sound scientifically proven. What? It is scientifically proven. Who made you a scientist, Axie? Who made you a scientist? I'm actually a real scientist. My name is Scientist Wudo. Wait, really? Can you do some science for me? Wudo's the dumbest scientist there is. Axie, it was just a joke. I'm not actually a scientist, but I think I'm smart enough to have built this entire water slide. And look at how far 
down it's going. This is epic. I'm going to try it right now, Axie. Are you ready? We are science geniuses. Go ahead. Let's go. Wee. I'm going down. I'm going down. And uh-oh, Axie, we ran out of water. You're taking too long to put down the sides of our water slide. I'm sorry, Wudo. I'll go faster. Come on, come on, come on. We don't have a lot of time. You know those sharks are going to come at sunset, and they're going to come after the axolotls first. It's already getting a little bit darker. Oh, no. Look, Axie, there's more water coming down. Let's just finish putting all these sandal bars over here to make sure we don't accidentally fly off the boat. And then this should be 100% safe. Oh, my gosh. It is amazing. Yeah. Now we can slide right into the water and get eaten by the sharks. Let's have a race, Axie. Get over here. The winner will get five billion cookies. You don't have five billion cookies, but okay. All right, let's go in three, two, one, go! Wee! Oh my gosh, Axie, this is so sick. Uh-oh, I'm going fast right into the ocean and boom. I think I hit the ocean before you. No, you didn't, Axie. So now you owe me 5 billion cookies. How would you like to pay for them? I'm not going to pay for them. I'm going to make them using my 5 million degree oven. Uh-oh, Axie, do you remember the last time you tried cooking your dessert dinner? It didn't end that way. Well, so let's not do that, okay? Okay, no cookies for you then. That's fine with me, Axie, as long as you're not blowing everything up. Come on, what we need to do right now is make this pool heated because all the water in it is way too cold to swim in. Can you finish putting all these magma blocks to heat it up? And while you do that, I'm gonna start working on the decorations outside of our beach area. More decorations? What are you going to decorate with this time? Well, Axie, I want to put down some beach chairs. As you know, when you go to the beach, you want to just sit back and chillax. And that's exactly what I'm building over here. Whoa, really? How are we going to chillax up here? Well, I'm putting down a bunch of reclining chairs. And I think what I'm also going to do is grab a bunch of sand. So it feels like you're at the beach when you're really on top of a boat. Whoa, that's super cool. Can we add some mud too? I don't think we should add any mud, Axie. But what we can add are some seashells. So now you don't even have to search for them. They're all 100% artificial. Can we add the kind that go crunch when you step on them? Wait, what? You step on seashells, Axie? That's so messed up. Imagine someone stepped on an axolotl. Would you be laughing then? These seashells don't have anyone left in them, Wudo. Look at this one. Oh, I see. This one kind of looks like a snail, Axie. Crunch. Oh, Axie, how dare you break it? That was somebody's home, you know. But it makes a really nice noise when it crunches. Oh, yeah, Axie. Do axolotls make a nice noise when you step on them, too? Hey, that's not the same. Okay, Axie. I was just joking. Come on. Enough with the jokes, though. I'm gonna put down some more recliners over here and a couple of normal tiki chairs. What's a tiki chair? A tiki chair is a chair that you sit on at a tiki bar. And I think we should actually add a tiki bar right over here. Because this pool area is out in the open, it can get really hot sometimes. And if that happens, we're gonna need some some ice cream to cool us down. So who wants some ice cream? Me, 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 me. I want cake flavored ice cream and worm flavored ice cream and mud flavored ice cream and turtle flavored ice cream. Axie, those flavors sound disgusting. What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? That nothing is wrong with me, Axie. I think there's something wrong with you because those sound nasty. Let me get some real ice cream flavors like chocolate, chocolate chip, apple, and vanilla. Those sound disgusting, Woodle. I want my worm ice cream. 
Mm, there is no worm ice cream, Axie. Who in the world wants to eat worms? I know I don't want to eat any worms. But they're so squishy, like noodles. But they're not noodles. They're nasty, Axie. Yeah, well, we can agree to disagree, Wudo. Okay, fine. In that case, I'm putting up some palm fences over here. And then I'm going to grab a nice sandy roof to put on top. Because then we can make make sure that the sun doesn't get through and burn us. It's going to get really hot while we're on the ocean for a long time. That's true. We should get some sunscreen. Sunscreen? How do you make sunscreen, Axie? And do axolotls even need to wear sunscreen? Well, we don't usually go outside because we live in caves. Oh, yeah. That is a good point, Axie. So check this out. How about instead you enjoy some delicious coconut trees? Drinks. Oh, okay, Woodo. Oh, I made something for you, though. You should try it. It's a worm on a stick. A worm on a stick? Ew! I'm launching this off the side of the boat, Axie. Wait, Axie actually jumped in the water for that thing? Gross. Who wants a worm on a stick? I bet all the people visiting this boat won't want it. So I'm going to put it in a display. Oh, no, Axie. Please don't. You can't tell me what to do. Okay, fine, Axie. I guess I can't. How about instead what I do is I spot in some pelicans. Look at their faces. They have these big mouths. Aw, they look really funny. Kind of like Mongo. I know, right? But it looks like they don't like the water too much. It's a little bit hot for them. So come on, Mr. Pelicans. We need to get you out the water so you don't burn. And oh gosh, they're burning, Axie. We need to rescue them. Come on, Pelicans. Just get out the water, please. Why do you guys like to sit here so much? And oh gosh, I guess now I have some raw pelican axie. Do you want to eat this instead of the worm? No, I don't want to eat the poor innocent pelican. Oh, I just took a bite of it and it actually tasted pretty good. What the heck, Woodo? You can't just eat anything. Sorry, Axie. I just wanted to give it a try and it didn't taste too bad. Whatever. Hey, wait, why are you eating pelican but not worm on a stick? Because pelican sounds a little bit more normal than worms, Axie. Worms are dirty. They come from the dirt in the ground. Yeah, well, people eat pigs and they're dirty. They roll in mud all day. Ew, then I don't want to eat any of those anymore. I think what I would want to do is take a nice delicious ice cream and lay down on these hammocks. Don't they look nice, Axie? They look super good. I'm gonna just take a quick Nap. Me, 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 me. Wait, Axie, don't take a nap. Wake up. Why? Sorry, Axie. I just needed your help still because we're not done building our boat. Look, I'm going to add some sand castles now because of how cool they look. I'm going to step on them. No. Axie, don't ruin my sand castles. I worked so hard to build them. Oh, I'm sorry, Woodle. I didn't mean to step on your sand castles. Well, I, I did mean to step on them, but I won't do it again. Thank you, Axie. I appreciate your apology. Hey, Mongo, do you have any sand castles on your boat? Because I want to step on yours. Um, I don't have any, but I'll add one right now. Yes. So that means we can destroy his instead, Axie. I called dibs on stepping on it first. Oh, uh, Axie, I was just joking. We're not actually gonna step on Mongos. That would be really, really mean. Oh, <laughs> too. Definitely. Axie, you were definitely not joking. You wanted to destroy his. Be honest. Uh, okay, fine. I wanted to destroy his, and I'm still gonna do it. Oh, gosh. Mongo, you hear that? Axie is showing no mercy. Yeah, yeah. I don't care. All right. Well, Axie, check this out. I think we're pretty much almost done with our amazing beach area. I'm just putting down some more coconut Going nuts over here. And now I think it is perfect. This is the coolest pool that I have ever seen on a boat. And plus, who wouldn't want to go down?
down our massive slide. It looks amazing. I think we're almost done with everything. We just need some defenses, though, before the sharks eat us. You're right, Axie. We need some defenses to protect ourselves against those sharks and, more importantly, Mongo. So let's go over here. And what we can do is grab some armor stands and put down the armor that we need to defeat all those mobs. While you do that, Woodle, I'm going to make a huge flat screen TV because we need to watch movies while suiting up. Oh, yeah, you're right. Movies usually have a lot of really good ideas for how we can destroy our enemies. So make sure it's a big screen with plenty of speakers, Axie. And while you do that, I'm going to pick out the armor sets that we need. It'll be the hugest TV ever. Axie, look at this armor I found. It looks like Axolotl armor. It's pink, just like you. It does? Oh, this is pretty cool. Give it to me. Oh, I just broke it. Axie, you can't destroy it, silly. You have to take off the armor. Here you go. Wodo, this armor fits me perfectly, but it's kind of just like wearing another Axie on top of Axie. Well, that's the whole point of armor, Axie. It's so that you can stay safe. Let's see. I think I want to add some other armor too. Check this out. This is some OP diving armor and it looks ready for battle. Whoa. I'm gonna draw a picture of you wearing the diving armor and put it on the TV. Look at this armor too, Axie. This one looks really scary, but it's red so it fits Mongo better. I need some fancy green armor. Let's see. There better be some fancy green armor or somewhere in... <gasps> Wait, I found it! How about the samurai armor? It's green and it's gonna make me look like a real ninja! I'm gonna draw you in that armor right now. It'll be so good. Wait, I thought you said you were gonna draw me in the other armor. You're gonna draw me in this armor too? Don't worry about it. I'm gonna draw you in some kind of armor. You'll see. Okay, Axie. Well, it better be a good drawing. I'm gonna put my beach outfit up here too. Check this out. It's gonna have my pelican rubber ring with some sunglasses and swim trunks and then my beach hat. There we go. That looks pretty fire to me. And now, the last thing I need to do is put down the most OP armor I have ever seen in Minecraft. Check out this lava armor, Axie. If Mongo really wants to mess with me, he's gonna get it. Yeah, he is gonna get it. This painting of you is so scary. He's probably gonna take one look and run away. Axie, what in the world is this? Are you painting me? Yeah. That is not me. Why did you make me look like this, bruh? That is so nasty. Ew. Wait, you're right. I missed the shell that you have on your belly. No, silly. That's not the problem. Why am I wearing a bikini? Isn't that what people wear to the beach? No, silly. I'm a turtle, so I wear trunks to the beach. You are wearing trunks, Woodle, and a bikini. I don't want a bikini. So you know what? I'm going to take this meat grinder and grind it in half. <laughs> no! You can't grind my drawing because I'm gonna put it everywhere. Okay, fine, Axie. I'll just put the meat grinder on display then. I'll also put some bazookas on display too. They were incredibly effective against Mongo's builds. Yeah, and we can destroy his build again. Really, Axie? Well, in that case, I have something even better. Check out these mech armors, Axie. We can use these to destroy Mongo. <laughs> <laughs> or I can use it to destroy you. Wait, wait, I can't really see out of this thing. Axie, you look so cute with your little eyes poking out of it. Oh my gosh, you look so funny. How dare you call me cute? I'm gonna destroy you. Wait, Axie, don't destroy me. I think we pretty much have everything we need to destroy Mongo. But let's go to his boat first and see how good it looks for now. Let's go! Oh my 
go. We're here at your boat. And wait, what? Why are there so many other boats, Mongo? What is going on? Because you guys need boats too. And this is my boat. You guys can take the other ones. Mongo, we literally have a gigantic, enormous boat right there. Exactly. Did you forget? Whatever, guys. Take a look at my boat. Back here, I have some fans that run it and make sure we can go to the seven seas. Then I have some little chairs to sit on. And over here, I have a campfire to cook all the food. And wait a second. I also have sleeping bags. Mongo, this is what you call a boat? This is not a boat. It looks like a boat plane. What are these white thingies on the side? What do you mean, Wudo? That's making it so the boat can go in all the different directions. Mongo, that is not what it does, silly. This literally looks like a mini airplane. I think these boats look even better, to be honest. Wudo, forget about the boats. I'm gonna do the thing I said I would do. Wait, what? What are you gonna do? You see this innocent sandcastle? Yeah. I'm gonna step on it in three, two, one. No! Oh my gosh, Axie! He kidnapped you! Don't worry, I'll crush it for you. Rah! You know what? That calls for a backflip at the front of the ship. Three, two, one, wee! Oh, wow, Mongo. That was even more impressive than your actual boat. I think that means that you're allowed to come to our massive mega yacht. Let's go, Axie. What in the world? This looks insane, Wudo. Do you like it, Mongo? This is our bedroom. As you can see, I have the best room of the view of the ocean while Axie is up here and then your view is back here. Wait, what? Why is my view back here? Now I dislike this build. Well, you're not allowed to see the real outside. You can only look at a painting because that's what you get. Oh my gosh. Fine. Then I guess I can spend all my time building in this area while you guys are sleeping. Sure. I don't really care, Mongo, because whatever you build is not going to look good. But how about I take you on a helicopter service to the top of the boat get on right now whoa a helicopter yep i'm gonna take you to our luxury restaurant right axie yep it's called the everything restaurant because we serve everything go ahead and try the food mongo it's a whole buffet there's no way you guys serve everything yep we do bread burgers hot dogs turkey lobster tacos sushi noodles, cheese, mushroom, and pizza. That's literally everything humans have ever invented. Nope. There's one thing you're missing. The ultimate food. What is that? Ice cream! Wait, Mongo! Hold your horses. Get back on the helicopter. I know exactly where I need to take you. Wait, what? Where are you taking me? Well, Mongo, we actually do have plenty of ice cream. Just ignore all that OP armor over there and let's land right on top of this pool where we have everything you would possibly want to enjoy while you're chillaxing at the beach whoa Wudo, you guys really do have everything here's our ice cream mongo go ahead and take a nibble mm, ready Wudo? three two one mm, 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 mm. oh my gosh mongo your mouth is huge you just ate the chicken Wait, Mongo, if you're so hungry, you should try my worm on a stick. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. What in the world was that? It's tasty, right? That is not tasty at all, Axie. Come on, Mongo, quick. Before you throw up, get in this boat so that you can go down. Whee! Yeah. Wait, Wudo, let's go! This is the coolest boat slide ever, Mongo! But I'm sorry I need to end it here. There's one thing that we built that we needed to in order to ensure the destruction of your boat. Get back in my helicopter! Wait, what? What are you talking about? Well, Mongo, if you go all the way to the very tippy top of the boat right over here, we built something called a defense station where we have all of our important armor and 
tools that we need to absolutely destroy you. That is actually insane. Ignore these drawings that Axie made. They're not related at all. But now, Mongo, you must prepare to die. Wudo, there's a weapon you don't have that I have. My firework gun. Pew, 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 pew. Take this, Mongo. Wudo, you're destroying our own build. Thank you guys so much for watching this video. If you enjoyed, then watch another video on screen. And don't forget to subscribe. Bye. Bye.